Hello friends, this is Atul from Super Wishlist. Today I am doing a small video review of the uh, digital Bluetooth music speaker or uh, the QFX Bluetooth boombox speaker. The model number is uh, RKS71 and uh, yes, this is the packaging. This looks neat and yeah, of uh, normally of the stuff that normally high quality speakers come with and let's see what's printed here it reads uh, support for USB and support for TF car and the, the FM function and the stereo output and the auxiliary input it uh, shows that there are four colors of the speaker and this one is blue these are the features and these are the technical specifications okay without further ado let's open the box this is the device and there are two cables inside one is uh, the auxiliary cable this is used for input as well as output from this device and then there is this micro USB charging cable ok let's keep these aside and move on to the device yeah, that's all that is inside the box so I think the device is simple enough to use they don't even supply a user manual with it okay so this is the device the Bluetooth is written on top of it so that makes many things clear and these are the two tiny speakers each one is 2 watts RMS uh, this is the mode button this is used to shift from different modes of operation of this speaker for example if you want to shift from Bluetooth to the music mode to the auxiliary mode or to the FM mode you use this button and then this is the play pause button and also the call answer and ending button this is the microphone this is used when you make any hands-free call with this device and this button is also dual purpose this is the previous and next button and also volume down and volume up button the buttons are have a pretty good tactile feel to them uh, I think these should last long okay there are a few ports on the back side of the device it reads line out so this will give you the stereo output to any other device and this is the auxiliary input if you want to plug in your phone or your laptop music or any other device which uh, supports 3.5 mm auxiliary output then you can uh, plug th uh, that device with this cable with the supplied cable inside this and the other end uh, to that device and get either input or the output okay now the next one is the SD card slot uh, this already has a slot but uh, has a card but that is not supplied in the box this is my personal card uh, this is the micro USB charging port and this is the USB port that is used, used to play music and this is the on off button on the bottom of the device uh, as you can see this is the battery compartment and it has a 1000 mAh BL5C battery uh, this is usually uh, supplied with old generation Nokia devices so if this uh, Bluetooth speaker ever runs out of battery uh, you maybe you can go to the market and purchase a new one and that's not very expensive also let's turn this device on by the way uh, by the way the manufacturer's specification for this device uh, playback capacity is three to four hours and I'm yet to test that out but yes this is the claim let's turn it on Music play mode. Okay, this says music play mode. Uh, this is the mode button. Let's try 
and see what modes are available. The Bluetooth device is ready to pair. Yeah, this is the Bluetooth mode. The radio mode. This is the radio mode. Aux input mode. Aux input mode. Music play mode. Okay, now back to music play the playback mode. Now let's check out the volume of this device. I have an application uh, that will give an approximate idea of uh, the decibel count of this uh, device. How loud this is. It is called the decibel tenth. Okay, let's turn it on. So as you can see, uh, it achieved a maximum of about 105 decibels. I cannot vouch for the accuracy of uh, this application, but yes, uh, I'm sitting in a 20 by 25 square foot hall. Uh, it is uh, sounding pretty loud in this open white space. Okay, let's keep this aside. Let's check out the Bluetooth mode now. All you need to do is uh, Turn the Bluetooth on, okay. And the first time around, uh, what uh, it will do is uh, when you turn it to Bluetooth. The Bluetooth mode, device is ready to pair. Okay, it will say that it is ready to pair. The Bluetooth device is connected uh, successfully. And since I've already paired it, so every next time it pairs up automatically. But for the first time. Uh, you have to go to your uh, Bluetooth uh, menu option and then you will see a list of devices and in, the, in that list you will see a device named S71. Just uh, press on that and it should pair up without any kind of uh, pairing code or anything else uh, at least in the iPhone and uh, should be as simple as in other devices as well. Okay, uh, since it's paired let's see how well the music plays from the device. Let's go to music. How about Honey Sing? Okay, as you can uh, see that is playing pretty well and I think uh, personally I felt the sound from the Bluetooth device is a little bit louder than uh, the music input from the USB or SD card slot and what I felt myself is uh, the sound is not distorted, it is pretty loud and bassy and still uh, the details were clear to hear, the treble was uh, uh, nice as well. Okay, let's see the build quality quality of the device. Uh, it is uh, made of uh, high quality plastic. And as you can see, it has a matte finish. Uh, it's a slightly rubberized feel to it. Uh, it is uh, good to hold in the palm. Uh, there is a blue light inside, blue light inside uh, device, which blinks when you get into the Bluetooth mode. 
so I think this is this is a pretty versatile device. You can use it uh, as a Bluetooth hands-free and use it to play music and use it to listen to the uh, FM radio and to make uh, conference calls uh, or to connect it uh, with the auxiliary cable to your laptop or uh, your mobile phone or any other device that has uh, inadequate sound uh, or if you just want to go to party and don't want to the hassle of carry, carrying uh, large speakers and other things with you and uh, yeah there are many uses you can use this in the car so this is a pretty versatile and uh, multi-purpose device and if uh, you want to buy this there's a link in the description just click on that uh, currently only the black blue color is available uh, yes that's about it this was a small video review of uh, the QFX or the RKS71 Bluetooth boombox I hope you liked it if you liked it then please uh, give me a thumbs up all right thanks a lot thanks for watching